YouTube. We're here with another Destiny video. I am your host, Shui. Let's go ahead and dive right into it. We are actually starting today the new series I am bringing to the channel called Reset What to Do. So every single Tuesday, I am going to be bringing you guys a video on pretty much what my plans are on what to do first, how to do it, what order to do it in, and everything that is updated and so far with the past week. So for today... Uh, before we dive into anything, I would like to apologize for my lack of uploads. I have been insanely sick for about the past three to four days. I have, if you can hear my voice, my voice is still very weak, and I am I am barely out of it, but I couldn't pretty much go any more days without recording. So I had to jump back in here and get some stuff done. But let's go ahead and jump right into everything that's going on. So it is reset, the first reset after the Taken King has released. And there are a couple quests I would like to cover just so you guys kind of know what you should have done for next reset because you're pretty much missed your opportunity. Um, one of them is called Jolly Holiday. You're going to have to kill people in the crucible with last word, with shotguns, with all sorts of stuff. Do like a bunch of crucible stuff and your reward is the exotic shotgun called the chaperone. And we're going to go ahead and run over here and grab that real quick. And as I'm running over here, let me just kind of give a disclaimer. The last word class is sort of janky a little bit. Um, it feels like you get about two points per kill. Or maybe like five points per kill. And you lose like ten or twelve per death. So like it's it's a really weird ratio. Um, we're going to go ahead and grab this right here. This beautiful looking little baby. Look at the chaperone. The chaperone. I like, I like it. I like it a lot. I don't have any legendaries to put on right now. <laughs> I can't even equip it. But alright, and the next one I would actually like to talk about, we technically don't have it yet. But the first, or the second arms day is coming up from the Taken King. And there's a quest you should definitely get and get done. And that is if you already have your sword, which is a Soul Edge or Void Edge or whatever it's called. Or whatever all of them are called, I can't remember. Um, if you have the quest done for that which is called a sword reforged you will then have to get kills in the crucible with a sword and then you'll have to also um i think there's one more step and i can't remember exactly what it is but then eventually you get the wait for delivery of arms day materials so you have to wait until tuesday so tomorrow breaking the fourth wall here recording this exactly on a tuesday um i will actually be able to turn this in and it's actually the quest to turn your legendary sword exotic so it's really, really definitely worth it because the exotic ability on all the swords are really good and they make them a lot more useful. So I would definitely recommend doing that. Um, Old Hunger, I don't really think that really has anyone. I've noticed a lot that the ones that have the uh, the sword sh like crest looking thing with the stripes and then the solid yellow and everything, a lot of them are weight quests. Like when you get to the final step, it's usually like a weight quest, but I'm not 100% I'm not sure. So what we're going to do now actually is we're going to go into orbit and I'm going to go ahead and go over the nightfall and the weekly heroic and all that kind of stuff and we're kind of going to just talk about that a little bit and then that should wrap up the video. Now they're not really going to be too long guys, just kind of a video I'm hoping kind of the community responds very well to. It's kind of like to help you guys plan out what you should do and what you shouldn't do. Like what's first, what's priority and everything like that. So let's take a gander at the Nightfall real quick. It has Epic, Void Burn, Berserk, Specialist, and Trickle. I'm not exactly sure what Berserk is, so let's excuse my voice, guys. Um, let's see. You guys already know what Epic does. Uh, heavily shielded and highly aggressive. Uh, void Burn, his void damage is greatly increased. Berserk, Minions of the Darkness won't flinch even after massive damage. Specialist is your snipers and every sniper shotgun and fusion rifles will have bonus damage. And trickle recharge of abilities is significantly significantly reduced. So I think trickle is definitely going to give some problems, just basically due to the fact that uh, a lot of the times when you want to go through, it is uh, uh, like you want to use invis and stuff like that, and that's going to recharge super super slow. And what is the strike exactly? The darkness grows stronger. Form a fire team of three and face our enemies in challenges. It doesn't actually tell you what the nightfall strike is. So. I don't know if maybe it's a randomized or anything like that. I have no idea how they do the new one. I know the last one was the night or the dark blade in the sunless cell strike. I'm not 100% exactly what the nightfall is going to be on this one. But uh, yeah, guys, if the if you did like this video and if you do 
think the series is going to work out and that you would actually watch it a lot, make sure you smash out that like button for me. You already know it's greatly appreciated. Uh, make sure you comment down below if you think I should add anything or take anything out in these videos. So I'm kind of tweak it a little bit, and uh, if the community and uh, the shoe crew can help me tweak it out and get it really good, that would be fantastic. And also, if you are new to my channel and you just came here to see what's going on, make sure you smash out that subscribe button as well to become part of the shoe crew. It's where all the cool kids hang out, we chill, we have a good time, and we learn a thing or two. And if you are into Smite and Destiny content, this is the place to be, guys. Alright, I'm going to get out of here, and I will talk to you later. Peace!